I photo 20. In your kit, you should have a, a tripod. Uh, a Bauer tripod should look something like this one, like that. And just a couple of things that I want you to know about it. When you open the legs out, this little center black piece slides down to the bottom to give you a stable base. These clippies on the legs open then to extend the legs. That's how you make your tripod taller and shorter. I strongly discourage the use of this little tiny crank. It's going to extend the little pipe out of the top to make your camera go up higher. That will not be stable. You're going to have vibration and your pictures won't be clear. Make the legs longer instead. The second thing, this handle here that we use for driving the camera around when we do video and whatnot also tips this level to use for your camera. In order to tip it, you may have to loosen the handle a little bit. The knob on this side is to loosen to make it rotate easy. When you rotate either of those things, left is going to loosen it, but if you keep turning it left to loosen, it will fall off. You will lose the little nut and washer out of the inside of this, and you will make this tripod completely useless. So don't do that. Turn this only as far as it takes to make it turn, then tighten it back up again. Little lever at the top releases the plate that then hooks into the bottom of your camera so that you can attach your camera to the top of the tripod and you're good to go. If things fall apart, let me know. Don't let me find out by opening your tripod to check it when you send it back in and it all falls apart in pieces. Yes, that has happened. Have fun shooting.